This one's for my swag bags. back again and this time since I'm kind of just trying to make as many videos as possible right now I was like yo I have a lot of supreme hats uh, this is excluding beanies I was like I have a lot of supreme hats so I'm gonna just make my full snapbacks and one bucket supreme list so yeah I'll probably tell you a little bit about like when I got them how I feel about each hat because you know not every hat you own is your favorite but yeah Let's get into it. Kicking it off with the lower piano. Really simple design, nothing special to it. All navy blue wool on the hat, super sick. I like like the, the structure of it. And bang, Supreme on the back coming through in the white. I don't know what type of font it is, but yeah, with the strap back, really simple, really cool. Lower piano tag right there. Uh, here we got a five panel, nothing special to it. It's This one was the Duckworth something. I forgot what these are called, but yeah. This has like the stripes going through it in the black and I really like that about it. Plus it was like black and, and brown, which is a really cool colorway, it always works. So yeah, that's why I copped this one. Another five panel. Wow, sub hat. Really dope, really sick. I fucks with it heavily. These are these are some of my favorites. Definitely would put them in the top 10 if I had one. Just because the sup was always cool to me. I used to get jealous of the beanies and I always wanted it like on a hat, snapback type of thing. So yeah, not much to it. Ain't nothing to it but to do it. This tree camo, uh, this tree camo one, I just copped recently. I think it was like in sometime during like April, May. One of the last snapbacks I copped tree camo I really like it this I wasn't really too fond of but I copped it anyway because if, if this wasn't there would have been really cool but I'm not complaining I still wore it I gave it some wears definitely cool with any all black or even some red shit because of the contrast I like the contrast and the cream color the Franklin pink or salmon bill just a hundred dollar bill the old school hundred dollar bill now this is before they updated it all around Pretty sick, I like it a lot. I'd say this one is like, I don't know, like one of my top two. Number two, yeah, I'd say this is like my second favorite Supreme one, because I love it so much. I don't know what type of camo this shit is, bro. Nah, this shit's crazy. <laughs> I got it wet, and now look at the shape of it. It was raining one day, and I was wearing this, and I was like, well, no umbrella, but this is cool. It kind of like dried out and kept the same shape. I like the color to it. Again, black and brown always mix very well. So yeah, I showed you number two. This is number three, the Orlando Magic inspired snapback. Dang, I, I love this one so much. Like I'm such a big fan because like you can wear this forward and it's a low key hat. You know what I'm saying? Like, all right, it's cool. It looks like some 90 shit. Then you flip it to the back if you do want to show off like, oh yeah, this is premium. But it's kind of cool when you're walking like once one year once you're in front of that person like they turn around they can see it they're like oh okay where that's supreme that's sick i've never seen that before dope blah 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 so yeah really cool the stitching here has like an outline of blue which is a small detail the bottom is also blue this one was an impulse buy i really just bought it so i could have had something to buy from when the spring 2014 season came out i was like fuck it i'm gonna buy it not really too fond of the font. Don't even know what font this is called. It's just Supreme going across two fucking parallel lines right there. Favorite part about it though is this right here. I love when Supreme puts this on anything. Cause it's it's like, it's the play on the starter thing. Like all the starter caps have the cool S, but this is better. It's like the money S, dog. What's up? We getting bills out here. My number one favorite Supreme hat. Bang, dude. Love it, man. Cause I don't like I've always associated red and because like the original box logo was white and red like this means so much to me like they might have retro this before like I made this before in the past I don't know but to my knowledge I think it's the first time it's been stuff on the side like this and it's just so cool dude like I used to wear this shit every day I probably will again when it's warmer and shit it's just so cool and it really goes with anything like red is red plays a big part of my outfit this is another one I wore a lot has no shape to it because there's no padding on the inside but the camo was really cool like i love this hat the trucker feel to it was also really cool 
supreme on the back or empress as it looks to me right now world's famous industrial supply just all camo trucker really simple but dope this one is inspired by the riot font i kind of like to think of it as a simpsons thing because you know it's like yellow blue red their colors I like the fact that it's that it's blue right here instead of black. It adds a cool a cool vibe to it. Red line, red and yellow always match. You already know. Yellow under brim, black strap on the back though. See, they didn't make it blue. They didn't kill it. So sick. All right, so you got me. It's not only Supreme. This is a vape one I caught this summer. Dope. I don't like vape brims, man. Like, what's up with this? What is up with this? They it like kind of sticks up. Like, what is up with that? But whatever. Nothing special. Babe tag on the back. Eight face on the front. Favorite part about this one is definitely this. The black on black camo. Kind of like that black on black bogo. I've seen some of the homies, the YouTube homies cop. So I got sweet. All right. Uh, this one is, I just put this one in it because it has a story. Uh, when this shit first came out, everyone was really big on it. Like Mintro, a 40 ounce man hype was crazy. And it took really long for me to get mine. So one day, like it took two weeks to get there. I'm like, damn, this dude stole my money, whatever. I got two in the mail, bro. I was like, damn. The UPS guy or the FedEx guy, I forgot who it was, was like, yo, you should probably like think about sending it back, like contacting it. And I was like, fuck that, dog. I'm keeping it, boy. So I sold the other one. This is the one that I wore a lot. Definitely don't wear it anymore, but yeah, it had its place and, and time and fashion. All red Supreme Corduroy with the uh, Chinese dragon on the on the front or the Chinese lion. Really cool. I fucked with this so much. The nylon looks like a jacket hat. This is uh this is 3M. It was really hot one day in the summer and this shit like flipped over, yo. Like I scratched at it because it was hot and I was like, damn, like 90 degrees will fuck some shit up. Yeah, it's kind of beat, but whatever. The one bucket I was talking about, Supreme CDG shirt collab number three. You got the stripes and the polka dot on one side. Then you got the legend, Harold Hunter, as a youngin, as a super youngin, killing the game. He right here is he's way younger than he was in, uh, in kids at this point. I'm not like, I'm not too big on uh, bucket hats. But, like, there's a time and a place for everything, you know what I'm saying? Like, I wore this a lot when we were in Cali because we were chilling on a beach. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, if I go to, like, Florida, Miami, I'm going to bust this out because it's tropical wear and it's tropical weather. This isn't something, like, you want to be rocking when you're walking through the concrete jungle and shit like that. So, yes, I realize some of you guys might have thought that was corny. You're not really into it. You've never seen us do a video like that. It was long. It was boring. Blah, blah, blah. But I just thought it was something I had to do, something I wanted to do, you know, now nah, get it out of the way kind of thing. Shout out to the person who just texted me. But yeah, guys, if you did enjoy it, leave a like, leave a comment, let me know what are your favorite Supreme snapbacks of all time. You probably have the name down and I'll fucking Google them and let you know what I think about them. So thank you for watching as always. Health and wealth, people. Health and wealth.